There are a million ties between running and success in life. And I draw from them often because they present this unique opportunity to see the world differently, to truly gain an advantage. And that's what success is ultimately about, right? Capitalizing on opportunities that are available to you. When you wake up to run in the morning, your head's clear, you're not in the midst of the day's complexities, there's no phones or electronics. It's you and the ground under your feet. Life in sort of the simplest form. I'm gonna discuss five ways that this sacred time can be a platform for your success. Number one is momentum. If you were to roll a ball down a hill, it's going to pick up speed as it makes its way towards the bottom. That's the very nature of momentum. And running in the morning is a great way to figuratively get your ball rolling. As humans, we feed off of accomplishments. So completing a run, especially while the rest of the neighborhood is still waking up, it mentally puts you one step ahead of the pack. It pushes you from one small accomplishment to another to another. It ultimately springboards you to a more productive and worthwhile day. Number two is reflection. All things, whether good, bad, ugly, beautiful, they're all a matter of perspective. So while you may be upset that your iPhone's broken or you have to deal with some undesirable stuff at work, the reality is that someone somewhere would give anything for a glass of clean drinking water. You know, someone's sleeping under a park bench. And my point is that it's very easy to forget how much we have and how lucky we are. And it's impossible to ever be successful if you're not aware and grateful for what you have. You'll always have this emptiness as you go about your day. So while you're running, you know, take a minute and just think about everything that's good in your life. This mentality is going to help you better cope with the bad things that come up and relish in the good. You'll feel grounded. Three is foresight. Imagine a professional sports team or athlete walking onto the field or court without any game plan. It almost seems unfathomable. Well, why should that be any different for you going about your day? You know, obtaining success doesn't become tangible until you've defined your objectives. There's this saying that you can't hit a target that isn't there. Well, a run is a great time to create that target. Take a minute, think about three goals for your day. That's it, three. You're relaxed, you're calm, it's the perfect environment to think about the things that would make your day a success. You do this and your day will be much more productive and efficient. Number four is competition. When you look at the most influential people who are living or have lived, whether they're politicians, entertainers, or whatever, they all seem to have something in common. They're constantly pushing themselves to be better. And while I certainly don't consider a morning run to be a race, there are elements associated with it that remind us of what success truly requires. When someone runs by you on the street, it should be perceived as a wake-up call. And it's not because you're trying to break some record in your city at 6 a.m., but because it's a reminder that no matter how hard you work, someone is always working harder. There's always a higher level to reach and conquer. And to take this concept with you as you go about your day, it can be the difference between mediocrity and excellence. You can always run a little bit harder. Just remember that. The last one is self-image. It's pretty much common knowledge that exercising transforms your physical appearance. But what's even more important is how you feel about yourself when you're disciplined and engaged in a consistent, healthy lifestyle. You begin to see yourself as a go-getter. Human beings will always follow through on who they believe they are. The best example I've heard is if you take someone who quits smoking, but they inherently believe they're a smoker, they're probably not gonna be able to break the habit. Now in the context of our example, if you believe you're someone who gets up early, stays fit, works hard, pushes yourself, then that mentality will expand far beyond your morning run. 
It filters into all aspects of your life because you're working hard to stay consistent with the person you think you are. You retain a winning mentality. If you can execute on these five things, I guarantee you, you will see improvements in your life. There's so much more right in front of you within your reach. You just need to recognize it and teach yourself to take it.